वेलकम टू माई व्यूज एंड न्यूज कंटिन्यूइंग आवर कवरेज ऑफ टूडेज प्रोटेस्ट एंड सेलिब्रेशन इन द अमहार एन रोमी रीजन ऑफ इथियोपिया वी हैव टू अपडेट्स फॉर यू इट सीम्स दैट द प्रोटेस्ट इन द अमहार रीजन वॉज नॉट ओनली अगेंस्ट इथियोपियन पी एम आर बी but also against top pp leaders amhara prosperity party uh, ethiopian prosperity party leader slogans were chanted against them banners were displayed denouncing them uh, and pmrb successfully prevented a demonstration in gondar so far Uh, we could not confirm any major rally in gondar and thirdly viewers eritrean soldiers have been spotted in addis ababa ethiopian capital what were they doing their pictures are being shared most sources say these are new pictures the pictures are from a hotel in addis ababa uh, we uh, must not forget that tigray delegation was in addis ababa for almost a week the delegation returned to makale around 48 hours ago was there any meeting between eritrean military commanders and tigray military and political leaders in addis ababa uh firstly viewers uh, today was a busy day uh romia amhara region groups took to the streets in romia it was a celebration of pm abi's five year rule that uh, pm abi led government is delivering it is bringing about change and this uh, journey to peace and prosperity should continue but in the amhara it was uh, a condemnation of the five year rule of the prime minister that amharas are being massacred amhara genocide is being committed amhara identity is in danger so two opposite political narratives are being built both are not uh, feasible side by side the two uh, different narratives uh, will have to be reconciled for peace and prosperity now what happened in the amhara region is that the protest was not only against pmrb but also against amhara pp pp leaders protesters uh, displayed banners with pictures of uh, top amhara leaders like uh, damake mekonnen who is deputy uh, prime minister and uh, foreign minister of ethiopia again here tishagar's uh, pictures were displayed uh, speaker of house of federation former president of the amhara region Germa Yashitila's pictures were displayed. He the his top uh, Amhara PP leader, and uh, the protesters uh, denounced the these Amhara leaders that they are not working to protect Amhara people. They are uh, loyal to Ethiopian federal government, not to the people of the Amhara region. Uh, you can see a picture on your screen showing a protest held in amhara region today uh, protesters displayed and denounced uh, uh, displayed the pictures and denounced amhara leaders uh, in a separate way to analyze the ongoing developments in the amhara region so far people are angry not only with the prime minister uh, but also with amhara leaders by the way these amhara leaders have uh, a history of working with the uh, eprdf as well uh, i think damake work with eprdf so uh, if they are working with pmrb's government it's not something new uh, but people are angry they want release of zamine kasi they want uh, 
they, 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 they want to ensure that Amhara special force is not dismantled. They, they want Volkayat and Raya to remain part of Amhara region. They are angry about displacements uh, from Addis Ababa, from Shagar city, uh, from Valaga towards Amhara. Lots of issues are being raised by the protesters. And these protests and celebrations point towards a future political landscape in Ethiopia, which will be uh, full of disputes if uh, there is no comprehensive uh, dialogue. Second level, PM Abi successfully prevented uh, a protest in Gondar. Yesterday, he was in Gondar, as we reported last night, and there he released a video message from Emperor. Facilities Palace, uh, his wife is from Gondar, Zinna Ashtacho is from Gondar and uh, he went to Gondar yesterday and there he announced that uh, the sale of his book, uh, money raised from the sale of his newly written book will be spent on projects in Gondar and I could not confirm any major demonstration uh, held in Gondar today. We received a few pictures from Debre Tabor. Even those pictures uh, are unconfirmed and those pictures don't show any massive uh, protests against the Prime Minister in Debre Tabor or in Gondar. So it can be safely said that PM Abi successfully prevented a major protest in Gondar. There might have been some small demonstrations, but no major demonstration. Protests were mainly centered in Gajam and Volo. Uh, that uh, we saw uh, demonstrations in different areas of, uh, especially Volo, and in uh, Gajam too. But uh, Gondar remained largely silent, and Gondar is the heart of Amhara region. Uh, so, PM Abi is not only showing his support from Romia, but he has some support in Amhara as well. Uh, Romos are flexing their muscles. There were, uh, there were thousands at today's uh, celebrations in support of PM Abi in different cities of Romia. Uh, thousands in almost all major cities of Romia. They are standing behind PM Abi. But in Amhara region, uh, he still, he still, PM Abi still has some following. That is why uh, we did not see any major protest in Gondar against the Prime Minister today. Thirdly, viewers, Eritrean soldiers have been spotted in Addis Ababa, Ethiopian capital, clad in their military uniforms. What are they doing there? Uh, they were seen at Sky uh, Light Hotel. Skylight Hotel is situated in Addis Ababa. You can see uh, some pictures on your screen. The pictures are from Skylight Hotel in Addis Ababa. The pictures show some security officials who are clad in uniforms uh, which are mostly worn by Eritrean soldiers. Are they Eritrean soldiers? It's difficult to say. Are these new pictures? I contacted uh, uh, a journalist from Addis Ababa who visits this hotel. He said, Sajid, this part of the hotel from where these pictures are being shared is newly built. It was opened for people in January 2023. It means these are not old pictures. And uh, then I asked questions about the TPLF delegation. Tigray delegation was in Addis Ababa uh, for around a week. It held meeting in Addis Ababa. Where did uh, Tigray delegation stay? Did it stay at uh, Skylight Hotel? He could not confirm, but another source confirmed that half of Tigray delegation stayed at a hotel owned by a Romo businessman. Ilale Hotel. There, Tegra delegation stayed for almost a week. Uh, so, it, uh, while rumors are being spread that uh, this Eritrean delegation held a meeting with the Tegra delegation in Addis Ababa, uh, it's difficult to say that it happened. Only confirmation is that uh, the pictures are new 
Eritrean soldiers, maybe their commanders were there in Addis Ababa, on which mission, it's not clear. Uh, but if a meeting happened between Tegarai and Eritrean leaders, it should be welcomed. That is what I have been suggesting for the past three to four months since the signing of the Pretoria deal. I've been saying for lasting peace in this region. One day, Tegarai and Eritrea will have to sit at the table. It's not that Tegarai is a country. Tegarai is obviously a region of Ethiopia. But through Ethiopian government, Tegarai can be involved in talks with Eritrea. That is the only way forward for lasting peace in this uh, region. And now other issues are cropping up as well. Uh, this uh, Today's rallies in, in Amhara Romia point towards uh, coming conflicts, political conflicts. Because uh, both regions are trying to propagate opposite narratives about uh, the government. So, we're going to see friction, tension, uh, political disputes in common days. If there is no comprehensive dialogue in Ethiopia and between Tegarai and Eritrea, Try to confirm if uh, there was a meeting between Tegarai and Eritrean leadership. So far, only uh, confirmation is that Eritrean soldiers, maybe their commanders, were spotted at a hotel in Addis Ababa recently. Thank you for watching.